Today we are talking about cryptocurrency. Watch this video to know how to build your cryptocurrency step by step. On our channel, we share thoughts on recent developments in the tech industry. Subscribe not to miss new videos. Here we go. To refresh your memory, here's a definition of a cryptocurrency. In simple words, it's a digital currency that uses encryption to create new units and confirm transactions. Here's a list of the most significant benefits. The very first thing is fraud risks elimination. It means crypto cannot be counterfeited and neither party can reverse past transactions. The next point is ensuring the anonymity of transactions. Besides, you'll reduce transaction costs. And finally, there is no big brother figure. Despite all these benefits, it's impossible to avoid drawbacks. Now we'll overview the main of them. As we have seen, cryptocurrencies are extremely volatile. Bitcoin's annualized 30-day volatility hit 116.62% on May 24th. The month started with the coin approaching the $60,000 mark, but in the second half of the month, it dropped to around $31,000. Such drastic changes in value will make anyone doubt and worry about the stability of the market. Cryptocurrencies are not supported everywhere. The technology is still in its infancy and regulators have not yet fully embraced it. Finally, the irreversibility of blockchain transactions can be a concern, as any small mistake can lead to the loss of funds. If you enter the wrong address, your money will be lost. Company executives may not understand why they should be interested in creating cryptocurrencies. So we want to share the benefits this can bring. First, you no longer need to pay for bank participation as you would with fiat currencies. Some fees are still required, but they are usually much lower. Moreover, with crypto, purchases remain private and are not linked to the user's data. This is similar to when you only use cash for a transaction. Money is hard to trace back to you. Finally, cryptocurrency transactions are encrypted, and the underlying blockchain technology verifies and secures the entire process. Now, it's time to overview two main ways to create a cryptocurrency. The first way is to create a coin. The coin creation can take as little as five minutes. You can simply copy the Bitcoin code, add a new variable, or even change the value of something. And that's it. You have your blockchain and a coin. However, you need to understand the code and how to modify it, which requires extensive coding skills. The other issue is maintaining, supporting, and promoting the coin, as you need to create all the blockchain logic to run your coin. Want to know more about blockchain and its trends? Jelvik's team prepared an in-depth article about the topic. The link is in the description. The second way is to develop a token. Fork cryptocurrency is based on top of the existing blockchain using the mechanism of trust, popularity, and consensus of the underlying technology. When you build a token on top of a secure blockchain like Ethereum, your token runs on a secure network that is immune to fraudulent attacks. So, you want to create a cryptocurrency, but where do you start? First, you have to decide which development route you're going to take. Creating a coin is a more complex option, and you will most likely need a team of experienced professionals. Having chosen the development of a token, you must choose the blockchain platform on which it will be based. Most likely, the choice will fall on Ethereum due to its smart contract capabilities and simplification of dApp development. However, there are other popular solutions that you can consider. The most prominent examples are Solana, Binance Smart Chain, Hyperledger. Let's briefly overview each of them. The best thing about Hyperledger is that it's made of six frameworks and seven tools which help businesses adopt blockchain at the enterprise level. What makes Solana the best structure for a blockchain is that it proposed a hybrid consensus mechanism that comprises decentralization to maximize speed. The innovation combination of POS and POH makes Solana a unique project in the blockchain industry. Users love Binance Smart Chain for its smart contract functionality and Ethereum virtual machine compatibility, combined with high blockchain throughput and three-second block time. This means that Ethereum native applications can easily switch to BSC and enjoy the benefits of faster speeds and lower fees. Now let's move on to the next step. Assuming you have chosen Ethereum, the next step is to create the smart contract and then deploy it to the test network. You will need to decide on the number of the token, what it will be called, its symbol, and decimal places. 
Finally, after you've tested and validated your coin, it's ready to run. Now that you know how to create a cryptocurrency for yourself, you can begin your journey. As you can see, this is not a very simple process. There's many decisions involved in the development of a cryptocurrency, and technical difficulties can arise at any time. So what do you think about creating your cryptocurrency and its potential for your business? This video was made by the Jelvix team. We help the world's leading brands innovate and accelerate digital transformation. We're sharing the latest on technology trends and innovations. So be sure to subscribe not to miss any videos and don't forget to press the bell button. Also, share what topics we need to cover further on our channel. You can find our contact details in the description box. Bye for now.